So I recently had someone that had tried Plexus for less than a month tell me that they were finished with the products because they said, and I quote, they were trash. In the past, this comment would have sent me down a panicked, anxiety-ridden, confusion-filled, and shamefully apologetic spiral, but not now. Why? Because I have a rock-solid belief in these products, and you can and should also. I have seen these products work. I have watched blood pressure drop, people come off of medication. Heck, I have been that person. Most people underestimate the power of their beliefs. Our beliefs dictate how we see the world and every de decision that we make while interacting with our world. Our beliefs are also at the core of self-sabotage. So when we have doubts in our beliefs, our unconscious will work hard to sabotage any conscious effort that we make. And everything you do will seem like a chore or like work. Psychology reveals that most struggling salespeople do not have rock solid belief, specifically rock solid belief in the industry, in the company, or beliefs in the products themselves. And when I say belief, I mean that there is a need for these products. You believe in what the company stands for, and you believe what the products are all about. You might tell people that you have belief, but what you tell people isn't the same thing as what you tell yourself. Your unconscious mind knows that you're lying, but don't worry, I can help you. Here are three ways to increase your belief. The first thing is to work on yourself first. Sometimes it isn't necessarily stemming from a belief in the product. It is truly a belief that you can do this. And how do you fix that? Be more awesome. A part of you knows that what you've been pitching isn't quite good enough. Your effort has been subpar. So go fix it. Listen to your intuition. Once your unconsciousness agrees that you and your product are dynamite, get back out there. What's the alternative? To give up altogether? Do you really want that? That leads me to number two. Those feelings that you're feeling are really you fearing the sales process itself. And how can you fix that? Make sure that you're participating in trainings. Watch videos on YouTube. Ask your upline for messages that they're using and then make them into your own. No one is good at everything in the very beginning. The final solution has to do with you trying to ignore the last two. You've realized that you don't quite believe in your industry, company, product, or in yourself 100%. How do you get past this? From this day on, make sure that you remain consciously aware of the products that you offer. Communicate your true beliefs about what you're selling. And you can do this by really researching the products and the company itself. If you have doubts or questions, find the answers. No one wants to buy something from someone that doesn't know what they're selling or why. And if you don't know the answer, be honest and then go find it. I hope that these tips help. My number one suggestion though, is to be consistent with the process. When you're consistent with the process, everything else will follow. Have a good day.